Welcome to Tech Games, and today we're going to be doing another review on the um, Elgato Game Capture HD. On this, you can record up to 1080p, 720p, um, and, and then you can record downwards. But um, there's two best quality you can record Xbox One, Xbox 360, PS3, PS4. With the slot there, you can record up to, in the AVI slots on old TV, so it's really good. You can kind of do more than. Um, but the new ones can record up to high quality and high resolution which is 60 fps and all that and it's slightly higher but I can't barely tell the difference it acts as a pass through so um, you can pass through it and it will just pass through and it won't have any lag on the dis on the screen unless you're just use so obsessed in, on input delay so if you have a small screen no lag if you have a big screen no lag just depending if you're mad about input delay and also that just passes through that USB just so you can go to the, get it to the computer on this you can stream add logos and more and we're going to be going over to the computer now now we're on the computer guys and I'm going to be going through all your settings and all that that you can do on the computer so um, I'm hoping you enjoyed that so far and um, now we're going to be, I'll be going to be saying what you can do. So on this, you can, you've got many options. So 1080p, 720p. This is a live 60. It's 30 frames per second, really. And with the pass through, it will just pass through a 60. And depending how good your TV is, my TV can only do 720. So that's why. And so yeah, guys, you can add a video title, game, description. I've only just updated this, so that's what's reset itself. Um, with the game audio, you can alter that. I will put it like there. Um, and the only reason I'm saying that because what if if you have the automatic reduced tracks, if you see I'm talking now, that's going blue. So as the game audio is going, firing, firing or whatever, um, with with card or all that it will reduce the audio down right down so right, right down to um so so you can um so you can still hear the game but you can hear you more and that works very well having that over so i recommend those settings you can change where you save it, capture it save it to i prefer videos because you can do editing rather than have it on all one big um, file I just prefer saving it to video and flashback recording um, you can have the stream command but well, my computer and the internet won't take it um, you can do it on any computer really I would recommend a like, free process computer now webcam separate live commentary audio separate so if you like to spice the audio um, on an editing software but your editing software didn't spit it like Movie Maker but like um, Sony Vegas Pro or um, or um, Premiere Pro, Adobe Premiere Pro, I think. But I just prefer editing on Movie Maker at the minute. It's just quite simple to use, and I, I could do a video on that. Um, you can update, check for local um, hotkeys. Sometimes you can just press a button on the keyboard. I prefer to press that big red capture button there and the decoder. But we won't go into that. So you've got your capture key where you can just click capture and it will just capture video with commentary, lowering the volume and then once you're finished you can just click that, boom, done um, and that might freeze for a second, don't worry your Elgato isn't broke, whatever Elgato you use. Normally if it, it seems a bit laggy, um, if you're going along here and this will just play as normal so that will play and it will just be that and you can just edit you can add overlays like webcams and all that with the stream command but i won't go into, into that um so overall this really good software so you can capture screenshots so you can screenshot your screen it is a bit lag so i'm just doing that now across and it's a bit of lag and yeah um this is only because um it's in that long time for the, it to pass through nicely and it's just so it can record but don't worry with your commentary and all that it will still put it together good it's just having time to that render those bits but if you watch it back 
it won't be laggy. So only if you have the Pro, the HD60, the new, but only if you have the Pro, that will um, give me the guys. That will just work work out. Only if you have the Pro and that and that's fitted to the motherboard of the PC, and so that can run a lot faster and enable real time capturing. But you don't really need that. So you, I've gone for the editing software info. You can check for updates. And uh, now um, just you can select the device Xbox One, obviously. And when recording with Xbox 360, just select Xbox One. Good thing about the um, HD, as I've mentioned before, you can record Xbox One, PS4, old gen consoles, Wii U, and and you can record iPad. I don't know how to do that. I might actually look into it because it'd be crisp quality. So you can do that. You can alter the picture. Now you can alter it brightness, really bright or bright. Whoa, that that is bright, guys. Um, and then you can alter the brightness down low or you can just alter it a bit a bit better than it is but and then you can alter the contrast I know this looks terrible some people love to mess around with it because they're obsessed with the um, try, trying to alter how it captures and all that so if I just alter that to 1080p because it resets everything to default um, yeah, so you can do that, you can do, do the audio again, but I prefer to just keep it like that, I would just keep it like that. Profiles, I don't really know what that is, and TV compatibility, just in case your TV plays up, and it's always best to on your Xbox if it won't um, cope um, with um, on, on your TV with 1080p, just alter it down to 720, and you can always alter it like that, and there's always the settings on the console. So I'm going to be showing you some gameplay now. Um, hopefully you um, en enjoyed this um, bit. So I'm going to show you some gameplay now. This is some gameplay, guys, in um, 1080p, um, 30 frames per second, quite crisp quality on Call of Duty Black Ops 3. And yeah, yeah, guys. So. Um, I will drop the links in the description to the Elgato game catch cards. I will give this a high rating and I recommend you should buy it.